If you like the content of this video or the content of my channel, click like, subscribe if you want to. But more importantly, go nowhere. Let's create. You're going to need some soft tacos. And I'm going to use a couple, maybe three, who knows. And clearly you're going to need the shrimp. Wild caught, in my case, Gulf, from the Gulf of Mexico. But you can use any type of shrimp. It doesn't matter. Just make sure they're clean, peel. You don't want any of that shell. You want it clean. Deep vein and do what you have to do. Onions, chop. This is about a quarter of an onion. Make sure you have some lime. I have about two that I cut in uh, quarters. Tomato. A tomato might be sufficient. I have a Roma tomato. This Roma tomato, I chop it. And in little squares, you know. And it's going to be ready. You want it fresh and nice. Mango. Get a mango. And here's how it looks. And I will show you how I chop it. You're also going to need some salt. I'm going to Himalayan today. You want the thin salt. Fine salt. You know, fine. You don't want the chunks or anything like that. I have some white wine vinegar. I have some peppercorn pepper, which I smash to make sure is, uh, you know, kind of thin. And I'm going to need some oil. I'm going vegetable because I'm going to cook the taco. And from the shrimp, you can go vegetable, extra virgin, and even you can go with the coconut oil. And finally, you're going to need some garlic powder, which is optional, but you must have cilantro, fresh. The shrimp, simple. Get a, the lime, squeeze it, and I think one quarter of lime, lime might be sufficient. Okay, that juice there. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the salt. You don't want it too salty, but you want it tasty. Garlic powder, not garlic salt, garlic powder. Not salt, garlic powder. Put a little bit. Let's sprinkle a little bit of the peppercorn, the squash. Just a little bit, you don't want a lot. Just a little bit. And this happened to be, this is not the black peppercorn, although you can use black. This one ha happened to be the one that had the three colors, you know, green, red, you know, but black peppercorn is sufficient. They're giving it a kick. Mix it up well. I like to have some mango. And I'm going to cut it here. And then I'm going to put some little wedges. See how easy? Sharp knife. Go there and then cross, cut. See how easy? This knife is very sharp, so it probably cut into the peel. And then what you do is you get it out here. See? How easy? Just get it out. The mango. So, simple. A little bit of the, about a teaspoon of the white 
wine vinegar, just about a teaspoon, maybe two. But a teaspoon might be sufficient. I'm using the cap, couple caps. It's about a teaspoon total. Get it that nice flavor. And I like to add a little bit of the pepper cum, just a little bit, not a lot. Just a tiny bit. If you want to use pepper instead, that's fine. Mix things up a little bit. Oh, that smells delicious. Don't squash it too hard because you don't want it to, you know, to, um, to become too smooshy. You don't want it smooshy. Pretty here in the cast iron, you can use anything, but I love this cast iron. Almost a hundred years old. And I'm going to go with the coconut oil. What do you think? Coconut oil. This is a medium high, by the way. Let this coconut oil. Give it that coconut taste, right? And smell. Let me melt it a little bit. And what I'm going to do now is Get that shrimp rolling. This is not going to take a long time. And I like the shrimp for this because it's not the big gigantic shrimp. So it's not super beautiful, you know, for a visual aspects of my meal. So I say, let's do some tacos, right? And you're going to cook it until they're cooked. You don't want them raw. Okay? About four minutes later, remove them. Put them aside in a plate. Say medium high. Copa nuts is above medium. Gas iron. Or any type of pan. It doesn't matter. Just do it a little bit of oil. I want vegetable. And now what you're going to do, when you're dealing with soft taco, you have to cook these babies, you know? Soft taco, you have to cook this baby for a few seconds, you know? Not even too long. Put it there. About 45 seconds in one side, maybe 30. And then what you're going to do, You're going to flip it, okay? See how it's bubbling a little bit? It's like going up. 